Well, we are looking here at the kidney. I know you've seen this before. So we're just going to talk about it grossly, and then we will talk about some of the microscopic features. First of all, the kidney is the main organ of the excretory system. It is built of billions of little tubes called nephrons, and at the beginning of each nephron, a web of capillaries releases much water and other molecules into the nephron. And the urine is collected in the urinary bladder, and when it fills up, it is excreted via the urethra into the outside environment. So how about some of these features? The cortex, this is the outer part of the kidney. The medulla is the inner portion of the kidney. The pyramids are the triangular shaped divisions of the medulla of the kidney. And the papilla are the narrow innermost tips of the pyramids and the pelvis. The kidney or renal pelvis is an extension of the upper end of the ureter, which is the tube that drains urine into the bladder. And then there is the calyx. Each calyx is a division of the renal pelvis. Opening into each calyx is the papilla of a pyramid. So here we have the cortex, which is the outer part of the kidney and now try to find the medulla. Here we can clearly see the medulla and next can you see the pyramids? Here are the renal pyramids and the renal medulla and now look for the papilla. Can you see papilla? Here are the renal papilla and the pelvis. Where is the pelvis of the kidney? Oh here is the renal pelvis here is the renal artery, the renal vein, and the calyx. Can you see the calyx? Well, here is the major calyx, which is the upper part, and here is the minor calyx, which is the bottom part. And just as an aside here, do you remember the bladder? What is the type of epithelium in the bladder? It is transitional epithelium.